guys, it's Nina Spears, The Baby Chick. Thank you so much for tuning in to The Baby Chick's channel. Today we are checking out Graco's Soothe and Sway 3-in-1 Bluetooth Swing. We were sent this to check it out. I love a good swing for an infant. It's not reasonable to think that you're gonna be able to hold your baby all the time. So to be able to put your baby somewhere safe, comfortably, is such a great way to go. Graco has been a brand that I have loved and trusted. They have quality products, great price points. So we wanted to check out this one and let you know our honest review on this new Soothe & Sway rocker. Regarding the assembly, it was super easy to do. It came in four pieces. So it was the seat, the base here, and then the two wings that really stabilize the base of the swing, as well as the wall cord to be able to plug it in and turn it on. So this Soothe & Sway rocker is set up three different ways. You can use it as an infant swing, an infant rocker, or a toddler rocker. So for the infant swing, it can seat up to 25 pounds. For an infant rocker, it's up to 20 pounds. And then for a toddler rocker, it is up to 40 pounds. When looking at the seat, you can see that there is this insert right here that really adds that extra cushioning. And you can see that there is a five point harness to make sure that your baby is seated safely if you do need to step away just for a moment and ensure that your little one isn't rolling around. But I love how you can re-thread it. I love that this is also machine washable, so you don't have to worry if baby spits up or has an accident, it's easy to clean. Now, I have this all the way on the highest setting for the seat, so this is really best for when your baby is six months old and has better head and neck control, but it also goes down. It has three different height positions, and I'll show you right now. There is a button on the back top of this seat. You're gonna press it inward and you'll see that this is the highest seat setting. And when you press it down slightly, it lowers a little bit and then press it down one more time and it fully lowers. And this is what's recommended for newborns up to four to six months old. Okay, so I'm gonna put this all the way back up for toddler seating so you can see it best. But it also has a height adjustment, which is really nice when you have a newborn, you don't wanna to have to bend down all the way. So you can adjust that as well. And this has four different positions. So this is all the way at the bottom. You're gonna press this button in the front and raise it up. So this is the highest position. Put this down, one lower. That's the third and then all the way at the bottom. I recommend when taking baby out of the swing that you lock the swing. Otherwise, when you're getting baby in and out, it will move quite a lot. And this is actually locked and look at how much it can already move. But when you unlock it, there is a button in the back that you press and it has a full swinging motion. So you can use this swing without turning it on. It can be just hand movement, using it manually, but like I said, sometimes you want this to be working without you doing the work for it. So to be able to plug it in and turn it on and swing on its own is wonderful. So let's turn it on and take a closer look. All right, to turn it on, you'll see that this is lit up once you plug it in. So you'll press down and everything will light up and you're gonna see your options. So as you can see, it has a number one and it starts swinging on its own. To pick up the speed, you're going to press this blue button that has these arrows that point from left to right and press it to go up. And this actually goes up to six different speeds. It does take a moment to be able to really pick up on the speed, so be patient with it as it gets its momentum. But you will see that it is rocking your baby. You don't have to manually do it, which is so nice. If your baby does like a little bit more of an aggressive swing, this might not be the best swing for you. This is more of a low, soft, soothing swing, which I personally love. This actually reminds me a lot of the Nuna Leaf. However, the Nuna Leaf, you cannot plug in, um, but it gives that almost drifting off to sleep, rocking motion, um, and it's a, it's a beautiful swing. To turn off the swing motion, once you're at six, you just press it and it'll go to zero. Or if you're at a level, let's say three, but you wanna turn it off, just hold it down and it'll go turned off. Now, the next thing you'll see to the left of it is a speaker with some volume. There's actually different sounds that you can do for noise. So this is the music. And to turn it up, you'll press the volume. This goes all the way up 
to nine. And then turns off. If you have it at a three and want to listen to that song and then turn it off, just hold it down and it goes down to one. But the music, there are nine different options. This is the first. As you can see, all of these sounds are either classical music or a lullaby. Anything to really relax your little one, I think these are great options if you're wanting to play some music. Also, another cool thing is you can hook this up to Bluetooth. If you click on the Bluetooth icon here, connect it to your phone, the speaker will actually play any music that you would like from your phone. Next, if you're wanting something else other than music, there are some nature sounds that you can do. There are also nine different options that you can do with this as well. This sounds like a river or a stream. Sounds like the forest with the birds. A heartbeat. Also sounds like rain in the rainforest. Sounds like running water, I guess. This sounds like a white noise or a brown noise. Sounds like fire, crackling fireside. This sounds like a storm. And this sounds like the ocean. So you can determine what you prefer your little one to listen to. And then this is one of my favorite features. It can also vibrate. So not only is this going to swing for you, but you can choose between four different options for vibration. It's one level, you can feel it very lightly. Two, just a tiny bit more. Three, definitely picks it up. You feel a difference between two and three. And four is great. Oh, this one, if you're having a fussy baby, put them in a swing, put that vibration on, you're gold. And once you have found kind of your baby's rhythm, the certain sound or the song, the vibration, the swing motion that you really love, you can actually put it as a favorite. So you select the heart with whatever combination that you prefer and put it as a favorite. So whenever you turn it on, select this and it'll go to your favorite settings. So my overall thoughts, I think this is actually a really great option. I believe right now it is currently retailing for $229. It is a little bit higher on, on the higher side for Graco pricing. However, it does plug into Bluetooth. It can play your different sounds. It does have different options. You can plug it in so it can swing on its own rather than just using it manually. I love that it can really grow with your child. You can use it as a, from newborn all the way up to toddler, which is 40 pounds. I mean, my three-year-old could still use this as a seat. I would just have to remove the seating and the harness and she could easily swing in this herself. So it is a piece that can really grow with your family and be used from baby to baby. So I think that that's great. The only con that I would have to say is I know that some babies do prefer a more aggressive swing to be able to help them go into a deeper sleep. It is a softer swing, so that is one thing to keep in mind if you're trying to choose a certain swing or rocker for your baby. That would be the one thing that I would say is this is more for just literally rocking your baby to sleep. Thanks for watching this video. Let us know your thoughts about this Graco Soothe and Sway Rocker Swing in the comments. And be sure to subscribe to Baby Chick's channel. We appreciate you. Take care. See you next time.